Okay, so coach, a great win. Um, how much is your influence, obviously, on the team, and what have you done differently with this team? No, thank you very much. Um, you know, I just thought, obviously, the last couple of days, the last four days, guys have been brilliant. You know, they've been very fantastic. In, you know, in uh, specific areas. I mean, we've seen Vian Lebe, you know, scoring another hundred, and then, I mean, just Temba, you know, uh, Temba and Vian Lebe in the first innings partnership. I mm. think that was crucial. You know, that really got us strongly into the game. You know, to set up the game nicely and. I mean, the second innings, um, in their first innings, you know, the, the, the bowlers, the, the bowling unit responded to, responded very brilliantly, you yeah. know, um, to restrict them to that, what, one, 138, 140. That was that was fantastic work, you know. Obviously, it was always going to be a bit of a, you know, um, a, a challenge in the second innings. You know, we needed to bet well, set them up and give ourselves enough time in the game to try and get, you know, those, those 10 wickets. And I thought, you know, um, the guys responded well in general, you know, well led by, by Temba Bavuma. You know, I thought, you know, over the the whole pretty much first half of this mm. campaign, he's been brilliant, you know, mm. from a from a captain, also as a team team leader and on and off the field, you know. So, no, brilliant performance from the guys. Yeah. And obviously, um, with regards to your balance in the side, you have a lot of experience, guys. So for you to come in and command your presence in, a, in the changing room, um, so what sort of methods did you use to, to do so? <laughs> no, I mean, you know what, I, I just... You know, stick to uh, my beliefs as a coach. You know, and obviously, uh, you know, get 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 the guys to understand mm -hmm. the big picture and and you know and and buy into it. And yeah. I mean, the experienced guys and inexperienced guys have pretty much bought into it. You know, as a unit. You know, we we had a workshop with them in the preseason, and you know, just to draw, just to try and obviously draw a picture in terms mm -hmm. of where we want Lions cricket to go. And yeah. and guys have been, you know, it's still a process. You know, not to say that we've, you you know, it's work in progress. You know, so. You know, guys, guys, guys are doing well on and off the field. You know, uh, there's always going to be challenges as a team, especially in this competitive environment. Uh, but those challenges, are, you know, they're always going to be healthy ones that can improve us as as human beings, as cricketers. You know, as long as you know we put the Lions cricket, you know, um, yeah, ahead of us, then you know it's all good. You know, so yeah, I mean, it's just basically the beliefs. You know, and fortunately enough, the whole team pretty much believes in one thing. You know, and uh, that's been exciting to see. And what was your approach from the beginning of the season? Did you did you set out like a three trophy to target, or did you say just take it one game at a time, or did you go like one tournament at a time? No, it's one definitely one game at a time. Yes, I mean, any, every franchise you know wants to win every every single uh, competition, you know. But our focus is to ensure that we understand each other as as, as cricketers, we understand each other, others' uh, processes, and we we actually back that hundred percent. You know, yes, we. We want to play an exciting brand of cricket, you know that um, that we feel, you know, will keep moving the game forward. But uh, ultimately, is you know trusting each other's processes and, and and beliefs, and as long as we all channeled into into one vision, you know, I think that's the most important thing, you know. So and so far, things obviously are working out. But again, you know, um, I mean, the guys have played so well so far. Mm -hmm. But we we're gonna continue to take it a game at a time, you know. I mean, you've seen it. You know, with you know the Cobras have been playing brilliantly. You know, and um, I mean at the end of the day, for this game, you know, obviously we we had to make sure that we we stick to what we do best, and it has worked out for us. You know, so you just never know. You know, the Knights have bounced back; they've won. So you just in, and that's an exciting thing about this competition is that you, just when you think maybe you know you you're gonna dominate, you know, it's funny things do happen. And every single team is very competitive. You know, they go into every game wanting to win. So that's for me. That's uh, that's an exciting part about our South African cricket at the moment. You know, so yeah, we just take it a game at a time and do our best and follow the the, the process that we've we've put out for ourselves. And uh, hopefully, we get a positive results. Thank you and good luck for the rest of the season. Yeah, thank you very much. Uh. Thank you. Okay.